Hello, sports fans. It's me, Sportsman Z. And I'm here today for game two of the San Francisco 1987 team versus the 1990 Reds in their semifinal round in the round robin tournament. And Cincinnati comes into this game and finds themselves up one game to nothing as they won game one against uh, against the uh, against the Giants and so they will have to see if they can come back if the Giants can come back and take the uh, you know and even up the series when for when they go back to um, when they go back to Cincinnati so We'll see if they can do that. Today on the mound for the 1987 Giants will be Rick Russell, who was 13 and 9 in 1987 with a 309 earned run average. And he'll go up against the All-American boy Jack Armstrong, who was 12 and 9 in 1990 with a 342 earned run average. And uh, let's see, I believe that's the there we go. All right, the lineups are ready to go. And uh, Jose Uribe will lead off against um, Jack Armstrong. He gets a 6-8, which is a single. So they, the Giants are wasting no time. They've already got a hit. After one batter and Will Clark up, Will the Thrill gets a 6-6, six, six, which is a pop out to short. One away. Kevin Mitchell gets a 6'11. That's a fly to right. The right fielder, I believe, is a. I think he's a four. Yeah, he's a four. So that might be big. That's a 17, though. That's probably an out. 17 4. It is. It's an out one, though. So Uribe goes to second. With two down and Jeff Leonard up. And that's a 6 5, which is a ground ball C. So the Giants get a man on, but they fail to score, and Bill Duran will face Rick Russell in the bottom of the first. And Billy Duran steps in, he gets a 1 7, that's a strikeout. Right in the middle of traffic. Barry Larkin gets a 6-7. That is a ground ball to the shortstop. He's a 1. That's Uribe. And that is an out. And that brings up Hal Morris. And he grounds out to second. And the Reds go quickly in the first. We go to the top of the second. Mike Goldrette gets a 1-7 and that's a single. So Mike Goldrette singles and Chili Davis is up. He gets a 5-6. That's a strikeout. One out. Robbie Thompson gets a 2-10, and that's a walk. The Giants have two men on. They have a little bit of a threat going here. Two men on with only... Um, they did get their second hit. With only one out. And Brenly up at the plate. He gets a 5-5. That's a strikeout. That's two down. And that brings up Eddie Milner, and he gets a 6-7, that's a fly ball. So, the Giants get nothing there. We go to the bottom of the second. Cincinnati looking to get a commanding two games to nothing lead in this series. Chris Sabo up, he gets a 1-8, that's a pop out to short. One out. Eric Davis gets a 5-11, that's a catcher card. And that'll be Brenly, and I believe he's a four. He is. A catcher four, and that's a three, and that's a pass ball, but it doesn't matter, and then followed by foul out. So two down, Glenn Bragg up six three, and that's a ground ball to the first baseman, and he is out. That's Will Clark making the play. No runs. We go to the top of the third. 
Uribe up top of the order. And he walks. So he's been on twice so far today. Will Clark gets a 3-3, which is a ground ball double play to second base. So two down and Kevin Mitchell up. And he gets a 1-9. That's a ground ball. We go to the bottom of the third, Billy Hatcher. Billy Hatcher gets a fly ball to left, one out. Herm Winningham gets a 1-6, that's a ground ball to the shortstop. There's two down quickly. The Reds don't even have a hit yet off Russell. And Oliver comes up, he gets a 6-8, and that's a fly ball to center. No runs, we're moving along quickly, top of the fourth. Jeffrey Leonard gets a 3-6, which is a single. So the Giants have had runners on. They've had their chances. They're going to look back if they lose this game and say, we could have done something. Aldrete comes up. He gets a 1-9. That's a ground ball. Second base double play. Two down. And Chili Davis up. He gets a 2-11. That is a ground ball to second base. And that's the inning. We go to the bottom of the fourth. Billy Duran up. He gets a 110. That is a double one to two. It'll be the Reds' first hit. That's a single. And he's a stealing A. He's going to try to steal second since they have so little offense. But that's a 17, and Bob Brunley guns him out. So there's one down. They tried to make something work there, and it didn't happen. That's a 6-6, six, six, which is a pop-out to first, two away. They wasted their only hit, their only base runner so far, and Hal Morris is up, and he grounds out to first. So we go to the top of the fifth. San Francisco up. Thompson at the plate, and he gets a ground ball to third. He's out. Bob Brenly gets a 4-7. That is a ground ball to second. That's Duran, and he's a three. I believe he's a three. He is. And that is a nine. Nine and three. He's out, two away. Eddie Milner gets a 2-7, and that's a fly ball to right. So we got a scoreless duel here. We go to the bottom of the fifth in a 0-0 game. Three hits for the Giants, only one for Cincinnati, and Sabo up. And he grounds to short, one away. Eric Davis gets a 3-7, and that is a triple one or a double. That'll be the Giants' second hit, and it's a double. With one out. And Glenn Braggs up. He gets a 3-10. That is a ground ball to the shortstop. Two away. And Billy Hatcher. And in fact, I have the wrong icon out there. And that's a 4-8. That is a single one to 16. And that is actually going to be a... Um, Line out to second base, and the Reds are out of the inning. Going to the top of the sixth, you get a feeling from this game that the first one to score is going to win the game. Uribe up. He singles. He's been on base all three times he's come to the plate. Will Clark up. He gets a 5-6. That's a strikeout. One away. Armstrong and Russell both on top of their games. Um, Mitchell up and he gets a 5-11. That's a walk. The Giants again have a threat. Two on. With only, um, in fact, I think the Giants got another hit. Two on with only one out and Jeff Leonard up. And he gets a 2-7, which is a ground ball third base double play. And erases, makes two outs that gets them out of the inning. And we go to the bottom of the sixth. Billy Hatcher up. 5-9. That's a strikeout. One away. Herm Winningham 
It's a 1-5, that's a strikeout, two away. And Joe Oliver gets a 1-5, and that's a strikeout. So both Russell and Armstrong pitching excellent baseball here. Top of the seventh. Aldrete up. He gets a 1-4, he's out. Ground out to first. Chili Davis gets a 5-8. That is... A double one to 11 or a single. They need the double out of that, and they do get it. Runner at second, one out. Thompson up. He gets a 2-3. That's a ground ball to the pitcher. Two away. No advancement. And Brenly is up, and he gets a 1-6, and he strikes out. We go to the bottom of the seventh. Billy Duran gets a 1-4. That's a walk. So Bill Duran's bored again. They are going to try to make him steal, even though he got gunned last time, but this time he does not. He steals second successfully. No outs. Runner at second. Barry Larkin up. 6-8. That's a fly to center. One away. Hal Morris gets a 2-4. That's a ground ball. First base A. Two away. And Chris Sabo at the plate. He gets a 4-11. That is a ground ball to first. That's Will Clark. He's a 2. That is a 17. Probably going to be an out. And it is. And they get no runs despite a leadoff single. And let's record that. And then a stolen base. And so we are in the top of the 8th. Now we are really in serious time here. Milner... 2-9. That's a strikeout. One out. Uribe gets a 1-10. That's a single. Uribe has been on base all four times. That man is a wrecking crew. It's too bad the rest of the Giants haven't decided to join him. Will Clark gets a 2-11. That's a ground ball. Second base double play. Just missing a home run. It probably would have iced the game, but it doesn't. And so Eric Davis will be up against Rick Russell. 6-3. That is a ground ball to first. One away. Glenn Bragg gets a 6-4. <coughs> That's a fly to center. And uh, the center fielder, well, let's see. It's probably out on everything. He is. Well, except for a five, and I know he's not a five, so that's two down. And Billy Hatcher is up. And that's a 2 10, that's a pop out. Pop out to uh, third base. We go to the top of the ninth. Kevin Mitchell up. 3 10, that's a walk. So Mitchell is aboard. Jeffrey Leonard gets a 4-4. That is a ground ball to the third baseman. That's Sabo. I believe Sabo is a 2. He is. And that's a 7. That's probably going to be a double play. It is. And there's 2 down with Aldrete up. And he gets a 4-6 and that's a strikeout. Well, here you go. You're in the bottom of the ninth now. If the Reds can get a run, they go home and they win this game, and they're ahead in the series two games to nothing. Winningham up. He grounds out to, to uh, first base, one away. Joe Oliver gets a 3-7. That's a single one to 15. And that is a single. So they have a man aboard. That's only their fourth hit of the game off Russell. Doran steps up. He gets a 6-7. That's a ground ball to the shortstop. He is a 1. That is a 9. And that may be an error. No, it isn't. It would have been if he was a 2, but it's a double play. And we're going to have some free baseball here, fans. So you've got the um, Chili Davis stepping up. He gets a 6-7. That is a fly ball to right field. One away. 
Rob Thompson gets a 4-7. That's a ground ball to second. He is a 3. That's a 5. I think it's an out. It is. And Bob Brenly up. And he gets a 4-7, and that's a ground ball to second. He's a 3. That's a fifth. That is a 15. That may be something. It isn't, though. It's an out. So, I mean, it is something. It's an out. So, we go to the bottom of the 10th. Barry Larkin gets a 5-7. That is a single. So, Barry Larkin leads off with a single. They got to get something going here. You want to win it here in the bottom of the 10th uh, inning. He's an A. He's going to try to steal. They got to make something happen. And it's a seven, so he does steal. Hal Morris up. They're going to let him hit because he's a great hitter, but he grounds out the first one away. Sabo is up. He gets a 6 3. That's a ground ball first base C, but it does move um, Larkin over to third. And now they got a man 90 feet away with Eric Davis up. And he gets a 1 6, which is a walk. So they have runners at the corners, two down. Glenn Braggs up. He gets a 4 8. That's a single one of 16. If this comes through. It doesn't. Unbelievable. It's a line out to second base. And so the Reds are retired in the 10th. And we go to the top of the 11th. Eddie Milner up. He gets a 2-7. That is a fly ball to um, right field. One away. Uribe gets a 210. That's a single. You know it. He's five. He's been on base five times in five plate appearances. Clark is up. That's a 4 4. That's a ground ball to the third baseman. He's a 2. That's a 15. That's going to be something. No, it isn't. It's a double play. And both pitchers are still out there, or at least. Um, he was in the top of the, Armstrong was in the top of the 11th, and here we are in the bottom of the 11th. Russell's still out there, 4-11. That's a ground ball to the first baseman. He's a 2. That's a 14. That's an out. Winningham gets a 1-6. It's a ground ball to the shortstop, 2 down. And Al Oliver gets a 3-7, which is a single one of 15. I'm not Al Oliver. I keep calling him Al Oliver. But anyway, he's out. Uh, it's Joe Oliver. And he lines out to shortstop. So, that's that. And the Reds will have a new pitcher in the top of the 12th. Top of the 12th, they're going to bring on Randy Myers. They've got three nasty boys out there. Two or three that they can rely on. Mitchell, or hope they can. Five, eight is a strikeout. One away. Jeffrey Leonard gets a 5-6. That's a strikeout. Two away. And Aldrete gets a 6-4. That's a home run. 1-11. to And that is a home run from Mike Aldrete. And he's going to touch them all. And the uh, Giants take a lead. And Chili Davis is up. He gets a 3-8. And that is a 3-8 a, a is a home run. They hit back-to-back -back homers. And Randy Myers has come on and undone all the good work that Armstrong did. And that's a 2-7, which is a single for Robbie Thompson. They just keep getting the hits now. Now they can't be stopped, it seems. And Bob Brenly is up. He gets a 1-8, and that's a ground ball to the shortstop. But San Francisco scored two in the top of the 12th. And in the bottom of the 12th, San Francisco will bring out a reliever because um, Russell has had a, definitely had enough. They're going to bring out Craig Lefferts and see if he can put this one away. Billy Duran up. He gets a 5-8. That's a fly ball to left. One away. Barry Larkin gets a 1-9. That's a ground ball to the shortstop. Two away. And 
Cal Morris gets a 2-9. That's a fly to right, and that is it. The Reds losing to San Francisco in Game 2 in extra innings in, the tw in 12 innings by the score of 2 nothing. And so the series is tied at 1, and that's it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.